Well, we all know about electric cars and how great they can be, but what about hybrid cars? I am with Dave from Ford Motor Company. Thanks for joining us, Absolutely, Dave. Sure thing. Okay, let's walk everybody through what this beautiful specimen of a car is behind us here. Certainly. Uh, so this is Ford C-Max Energy Solar Concept. Whoop, I'm sorry. That's okay. <laughs> what we did is we took a production level C-Max Energy, our plug-in hybrid, and we put solar panels on the roof, uh, as well as coupled it with what you can see above the car, which is a, a solar collector lens. And that's part of the, the novel uh, innovation that we've come up with here. Ford recognizes we're not the first company to think of putting solar panels on a car. But what is innovative here is that by parking it, the car underneath that solar collector, it magnifies the sun, it boosts the power of the, of the solar panels that are on the car and thereby enabling the lithium ion battery that's in the rear of the car to be fully recharged over the course of a day in the sun underneath the collector. Okay, so these collectors, are they just commercial use? Or if somebody wants to buy this car, could I install a collector over top of my own car as my own little parking spot to recharge my car? <laughs> well, so what's on the car right now, the solar panels themselves are production level uh, panels from SunPower manufacturer. They're the most high efficiency panels uh, in the industry right now, monocrystalline cells. And that's the part of the neat thing that we've done with this concept is that we're taking elements that are already in production off the shelf and putting them together in a new way that no one has done before. So to your question of, you know, could you put this together yourself? In, sim in the same way, that lens that's above the car, it's called a Fresnel lens. It's an acrylic a plastic lens. Um, they've been around for years and years and years. So it's something where now you have to be quite careful with it because it, it magnifies. I mean, think of people frying ants with uh, a magnifying glass. I mean, this isn't that. Um, but it will take a lot of sun and concentrate it onto an area. And so that's the key to make this whole thing work is that it takes a larger footprint of sun and makes it smaller to fit on top of the car. And so how long does a charge like that last? Like how far could I get? How many days could I drive? But, drive it? The car, the C-Max Energy has 21 miles of, of pure electric range and that's no different on this. Uh, the battery to do that is an 8 kilowatt hour battery and so by parking under this solar collector you'd be able to charge this 8 kilowatt hour battery over a day in the sun and it would allow you to go 21 pure electric miles. Now, being a hybrid, does this also run on gas as well or no? It does. So this production vehicle is a parallel hybrid. It runs on both gas and electric. Um, it's got some really great functionality in the vehicle where as a driver you can make some choices uh, with some uh, uh, button selections in the car to say, uh, I want to drive in EV mode now and it, it, it intentionally keeps the gas engine off so it's essentially like you're driving a full electric car for 21 miles. So there's a lot of great flexibility and functionality built into the car as a production model. So what are some of your favorite features of this hybrid? Well, it's just, you know, Ford Motor Company cares very much about advancing customer um, choices for uh, sustainable transportation options. and. One of the things that we introduced last year at CES was to bring together uh, vehicle charging with some of the other home electricity needs that you typically have, and how do you do that in an economical way that can save money and even benefit the environment. What's neat about this year is it's taking that concept a little bit further and saying, all right, we're not even going to charge the car on the grid anymore. We're just going to take the car completely off the grid and charge it with the free power of the sun. And that's the real powerful idea that we're trying to put out here in front of everybody at this year. I love how eco-friendly that is. Yeah, it's so really where can people get more information? Well, um, this is a concept right now. Um, we don't have any imminent plans to come. But we want it now, know, Dave. That's, that's the most frequently <laughs> asked question of the show for us. Um, so, I mean, we don't have any of this information up on a website, uh, at least not yet. So, I mean, the information that's available has been through some of our press releases over the last couple days. Um, so everybody has to keep waiting with bated breath that, for this hybrid right. car. And perhaps one day you'll see a Ford vehicle with a solar panel on the roof. I hope so. Hopefully. Thank you so, so much for your time. Oh, Appreciate it.